What's happening, everybody? We are on uh, Lake Massabasic. Uh Again, this is my second time here. The water is now 66 degrees, which is like ideal for a lot of species, except for the cold water ones. They do stock this with trout. Uh, I know there's bass in here, of course. Um, I caught a bunch of pickerel here last time, and I haven't really produced that yet. It wasn't enough footage to uh, share with you guys for the most part. So we're gonna try something a little bit different today. Um, now that the water's warmer, and we'll see if we can get onto some some fish, ideally. So I think I'm gonna do a swim bait. Haven't even finished my coffee yet, but it's supposed to be like 85 something degrees today. Nice and toasty. four feet of water and I can't see the bottom so super stained typical New Hampshire um, water basically and we're gonna put on a uh, perch colored bait here and that should be pretty good a lot of my baits are uh, really garlicky scented not I can add more garlic scent to it basically like an oil slick, which is kind of cool. Get up there. Ooh, that looks freaking nice. So let's go, um, there's a nice, so I have the side scan on like I normally do. There's a nice uh, rock bar to my left here. Let's see if there's any fish. There we go. Nice little largey. Sweet deal. They do exist in here. Fish, 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 fish. Line in the boat. Another little large mouth. So we have a mix of uh, last year's weeds, still trying to sprout up. Uh, sandy and muddy bottom, it looks like. And we get a mix pretty much everywhere. And I got wind blowing up my back, so I'm kind of not covering as much water as I want to, like with the lure, but I'm covering water with the boat. This looks like a really good spot. Drag it through the weeds over here. All right, the fish should be all down here. It's all been wind blowing all morning. But uh, we'll see anyways. It's a little shallower than, uh, I've been fishing, but it seems like they're up pretty shallow. I mean, it could be just males that are up, but I'm pretty sure the bass have Looks like they spawned already, here at least. Got perch galore though. Big bass. Big bass, guys, big bass. 
Not too big. Two or three pound Ian. Hail back. Absolutely choked it. Look at that. Choked it right down there. Nice fish. Get the release. See you, bud. Nice. These swim baits, like I said before, I'll leave a link in the description on how to contact uh, John below or Riley's Custom Bass Baits. He'll make any color you want, basically, and these things are badass. Oh, saw that happen. Oh, he's off. That was a smallmouth, too. That was sweet. Messed up my lure. I got fish to the left of me, fish to the right. About 400 perch following my lure. Hopefully there is a bass around them somewhere. That will entertain the bait. Oh, yeah. But so. Just a small large mouth. He's a little guy. He's a little guy. Come on, fish, I know you're in there. It'd be cool to catch a stock book trout on a freaking three and a half inch, oh, like that. I need a little sucker back there. Little squeaker. All right, guys, that's all she wrote. Uh, one smallie and a bunch of medium sized largemouth bass probably up to like maybe three pounds not nothing too big probably all males still hanging around the beds uh look like the i've missed the bed you know the bedding not that i really want to fish beds but make sure you uh like comment and subscribe